I did it. I'm back. There is a sea of freaking people. Uh, you can't see it, but there's probably 300 cars in this parking lot. And by the way, this over here, this Olive Garden in Attleboro, Massachusetts is the, look at that, is the busiest freaking Olive Garden I have ever seen in my life. I don't know what the heck they're doing over there. The walk of shame right now, guys, the walk of shame. Took me an hour to get this. <laughs> I remembered why I didn't go again for a long time. Market basket is an experience. It's not even shopping. This video is not sponsored by Cardi's unless they want to cut a check. Because I know they got enough checks. Uh, all right, guys. So, basically, I got a bunch of stuff to nibble on. I saw these uh, shrimp spring rolls, six bucks and change. Not bad, look at that. They charge you for extra spicy mayonnaise. I don't know, I don't know how I feel about that. But, gotta let it go. Um, also, uh, here we go, tomato and lemon orzo salad. That's gonna hit beautifully. Look at this! I got a strawberry shortcake. What? That whole freaking dessert. But, and I also got, um, I got some chips and uh, chips and dip for La Casa. But man, they were out of everything. Look at this. This is the ripest. This looks like it just, like I want to go back to Mexico and put it back on the tree. Be like, go back home. All right, guys. But the, the creme de la creme. The Arctur Humph. I forgot who it was. When I first started this channel, and some people were coming over from B Loves Life channel when she shot us shot us out a couple times. Uh, people were like, you have to do the rotisserie. Now there is a challenge where you eat the whole rotisserie. We will not be partaking in that challenge today. I am fully prepared to get this beautiful white shirt absolutely demolished. But let's set this up, guys, and then we'll get to eating. Four sixty nine, not bad. Immediate, uh, ad admittedly, guys, I don't eat much um, roasted uh, chicken, but this does look bomb. We're just gonna go right into. The breast, the breast assist. Ooh, that looks good. Oh yeah. Oh, whatever seasoning that they use. Official, baby. Mmm. So there's a challenge with this. Suppose I guess you're supposed to eat the whole thing. But I also got it because I wanted to make some Sammies at home for like lunch the other, the other day. Mmm. I'll tell you what, guys. If you catch me on a really hungry day, I'm always hungry, but if you catch me like on a hungry, hungry day, I can demolish this. Orzo salad, man, all day. Guys, what the, what, market basket, what? How is it a zoo? And they, they took a page out of Walmart's book and they're like, you think we're gonna give you enough room for two carts to go side by side through the aisles? No. Oh, there we go. I was like, there's supposed to be like olive oil or something in here. Mm. When you eat something like this, you have to have something fresh like that. 
just to balance it out. Hmm. When is the best time to go to Market Basket? Like right when they open? I wish that seasoning was like inside too. We'll probably eat half of this. Mm. Good soup. All right. <clears throat> they have a whole separate team that's doing the sushi, the spring rolls. The cool thing, I will say, it's it's kind of cool, but because they have like a little bit of everything there, you're kind of like, oh, like, look at this. This is the weirdest meal probably ever. But I keep seeing, I kept seeing like things and I was like, oh, I got to get that. I got to get that. There was one guy, man. There was, there was one guy over there. Heated. Absolutely heated. Because they made the um, uh, the chicken wings a little crispier than usual. Mmm. Oh, my God. I'm sorry, fam. I have sensitive teeth. That was really cold. Oh, my God. But there was this one guy out there. <laughs> He's like, I've been going, I've been coming to Market Basket for 20 years. And in my head, I'm like, this Market Basket's only been here a few years, dude. Like, it hasn't been, it hasn't been here since 2001. <sighs> Think about that for a second. 2001 was 20 years ago. How old are, <laughs> how old do we feel? But man, he was upset. He came down with the vengeance of God. And the poor kid, the poor little 18 year old kid that was, I guess, he kind of looked like a manager. But I mean, these days, you know, it's, it's hard to find staff. But he basically was just like digging into him. And he's one of those guys that in public, he tries to get the crowd with him. So before he could even look at me, I looked at my phone. I was like, I'm not joining your little tupper tantrum. Just ask him to make another batch. Which is what the kid ended up doing. And here's my one thing. If I could write a letter... to uh, the CEO or the higher ups at Market Basket. There needs to be some sort of system. You guys have to sit down with all the money you're making from all these people ordering. Sit down. Figure out a system. Of how people order at the at the prepared food section, man. That is, they have like four lines happening. You don't know what the hell is going on. So like me, you end up just getting like the stuff that's prepared already. Maybe maybe that's what they want. I didn't even think about that. Hmm. Well. Get your veggies in, kids. But I, I will say, this one lady. Also, guys, you have to have patience, man. I felt so lit. I felt so bad for the lady that was making the sandwiches. It's not Subway. If you want something in thirty seconds? Go to Subway. This 
poor lady was making an Italian, which looked really good. She did a good job. Um, excuse me. She did a really, really good job. But the guy was just like staring at her the whole time. Getting as close to the freaking glass. I, was, I wanted to like pull him away, but I knew that would have just started a whole thing. And you know, there's some people out there that can't let things go. All right, here we go. I'm trying not to push too hard on my tray here. That would be the worst time ever. Oh, we got a little wing. Mmm. Mm. Oh, boom. Whatever, whatever seasoning they use here is absolutely phenomenal. We're just going to use our fingers. Mmm. You guys okay with me using my fingers? Mm. Alright, how do I get this bad boy off? Ooh, that was easy. And do a twist. Learning it. I think if we end up doing another um, market basket video, I might go like super early. Mm. Yeah, rotisserie is real tap. That's skin, man. Huh. Ah. Mm. That's bomb. Does KFC sell? Oh my God. Can you imagine how much money KFC would make if they took what uh, Mark, um, Boston Market, like was what used to be Bar uh, Boston Market? Hate me. Mm. Who's ready for this? That was good, man. I'm trying to like save some for like lunch tomorrow or lunch later on, rather. <sighs> because all this week, guys, I got to figure out where to store a lot of my stuff. I gotta look at uh, rental units. Look that. How much is this? Three bucks. Mmm. That is phenomenal. What the hell happened to my fork? Did I do that? The chicken did that. the weirdest video ever also i hope that you guys joined on the uh on the on the live too that breakfast live was fun <gasps> whoa 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 wee wee whoa whoa there we go oh yeah this is not healthy for you i like how they didn't put any nutritional facts on this Mmm. Where's the... Oh, there. There's the cake. I was trying to find a piece of the cake. Oh, my God. There's just so much of that cream frosting. That's going to do it today, fam.
all this too it was about 20 bucks 20 bucks can you imagine I'm starting to see why uh, Market Basket is so popular, but man, they gotta they gotta figure out some systems, man. That is a complete zoo. I think that they, I think that they would sell more if they figure out some sort of system. I wish they put more shortbread. There we go. They figure out a system, I'm there all the time. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Market basket. <laughs> we'll figure out something, guys. I might have to like go when they open or right when they close. Man, this is I thought I was gonna demolish this, but this is sweet. I need like a like a glass of milk. Be well, eat well, take care of each other, and get the freaking rotisserie. Man, four sixty nine. How how are they even making money? I don't know how they do it. Cheers.